This is KT Bradford and I'm here at the Dell Venue at the Aventi Hotel in New York City checking out the Dell Venue. This is the Dell Venue 11 Pro. It has a 10.8 inch display. It runs Windows, uh, full Windows. It's going to run 8.1 when it comes out. And it comes with in two different varieties. So this guy right here is the one that's going to come with Intel Core i processors. And so it is a little bit thicker than its neighbor. Um, it has a slightly different button configuration, but in most respects it's going to be the same uh, on the outside. It's just that on the inside, they have different processors. This right here is the Atom version. Like I said, a little bit thinner, different button configuration, Atom processor inside. Uh, these two venues, these two venues are both sitting on the keyboard docks that are going to be available for them. These keyboard docks are kind of interesting. So let's take a look at this one first. This one is actually more the kind of keyboard dock that we've seen on convertible Windows tab tablets from the beginning. So once you close it, it's like a, it, it's like an ultra book. This is going to give you uh, pretty much the same feeling that you would get with a convertible Ultrabook type of dealy. It's solid and there's a battery in the base and the battery is supposed to double the power on this. And so I believe with uh, this one they were talking about 17 hours of battery life which is awesome. Now this cover here is more of the type cover and it's very thin. So you'll see uh, this is uh, very much akin to what you get with the Surface Pro 2. And, but it does not have a backlit keyboard or anything, but these keys do press it. So this keyboard, the one that, the keyboard dock that has the battery in it and it makes it feel more like an actual Ultrabook once you connect it up, is actually quite nice. The touchpad is really nice and responsive. And the keys themselves give you pretty good tactile feedback actually. Um, definitely better than the thinner type cover here, which these keys do depress, but the, it feels very plasticky and unpleasant, especially if you have nails. Another difference in the keyboard covers is that with this one, you only get one angle that you can set the tablet in. With this one, you get almost a full range. Now one thing that's really interesting about this Core i version of the Dell Venue Pro is that this actually feels like it's a bit lighter than the Surface Pro. And though the Surface Pro has a slightly smaller screen, it's 10.5, uh, this is 10.8, but it actually feels like it's a little bit lighter. The Atom version is definitely lighter, and it also is just more comfortable to hold in the hand. It just feels like a tablet that you might actually want to hold. The Dell Venue 11 Pro is going to be out sometime in November. We don't have anything more specific than that right now. The Atom version is going to start at $499. And the Core i version, we don't know pricing yet. Dell has not told us. We'll find out probably as we get closer to November. This is KT Bradford at the Dell Venue, checking out the Dell Venue 11 Pro.